After watching the scrimmage, um, again there were some there were some really good things in there. Uh, I felt like we make a we made a big jump defensively. Uh, you know, as I touched on after the scrimmage, depth is an issue, but uh, but we're going to be we're going to be just fine. You know, as you piece it all together and put everybody together and, and uh, move some guys around, we're going to be in, in good shape and uh, anxious to get in the game week. So we'll have our last two a day today and, uh, and have one tomorrow and start school on, on Wednesday. So uh, we're anxious to put it all together and get in the game with here soon. Mark, you're really hands-on over there in the secondary. Have you gotten to a point, do you feel really comfortable just walking away, turning your back on the offense and, and really focusing now on that side? Well, of the that's what I do during practice, but we watch everything together. So I watch every offensive snap with the offensive coaches and every defensive snap with the defensive coaches. So. So I have a good handle on what they're doing, but yeah, I have great confidence in in, in, in what they're doing, and, and uh, so. But I'm always gonna, you know, pay attention to it and know what, know what's happening over there. But uh, during practice, I'm definitely working with the secondary. Elam had a cast on his left hand. Is that a nothing major? Just nothing. Just preventative. Just something with his thumb. Or, Is he holding up better now? The, the shape that he's in, it seems like maybe a little bit. Yeah. I mean, Matt, uh, you know, he's, he's got to continue to fundamentally play, play better. Um, he's improved in certain areas. His, his conditioning, his weight is better, but uh, it's still a work in progress. It looked like he was back full go. Are there Pardon any me? more? It looked like he was back yeah. full go. Is there any more injury updates after today? Um, you know, you, there, there's, there's guys that are dinged up and out a little bit. Um, Ramsey was a little bit sick today, throwing up. And had some issues this morning. He should be fine. Uh, Jabari, Jabari will be back in a couple of days. Bunchy will be back, be back tomorrow. Uh, a couple guys in, in red that were just a little bit dinged up, but nothing. Members for Saturday, you kind of have an idea of which of those new guys you're going to prepare to go into the first one. Yeah, we're, we're, we're working on it. I think uh, TJ Carter's a guy that'll, that'll play. You know, that we'll need to bring along and play. Um, Cash, I think, is a guy that we have to look at defensively. So. Mark, I saw over the weekend you said you might use both partners. Is yeah. that because it's just too close to call, or is it situational? Yeah, I mean, you're out here today, as you see. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, you're splitting hairs right now. We'll let them keep on battling and see what happens. Both of them hit, hit, hit some very good ones, and both of them have been a little bit inconsistent. So, we'll see. Talk what about your linebackers, and, and where does Jordan Jones fit in with them right now? Yeah, Jordan is, uh, he and Eli are, are battling for the starting will linebacker position. Both of them have showed uh, very good promise. Um, both make a few few mistakes, but they're playing really good football. Um, he actually got a little bit dinged up with his shoulder, nothing major. Jordan? So he was at, yeah, so he, was, he, out of, there he was out of some of the full, full content stuff today. Is he? But, uh, but yeah, he's done some good things. He played much better on Saturday. Is he out of your doghouse a little bit? No, I don't know if he'll ever get out of the doghouse. <laughs> he is from Mooney. He can't ever take your foot off those guys. He's <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah. pretty well, careful about managing expectations over the last few years. What tells you that now is the time to start to reap some oh, benefits? You know, again, all the things I've preached on all summer, we've done that. You know, our team has been able to handle more. They, they, practice hard, they've had great attention to detail, they're focused, um, you know, we're more mature, you know, physically we can handle more and mentally we can handle more. And uh, you put that together with some depth and, and you know, uh, you, you got a much better team. And, uh, you know, like always, I'm not pessimistic, but, but you know, like always, you certainly want more depth and more players. I mean, that's the league we're in, right? I mean, heck, everybody, everybody wants more good players. He's still yeah. undetermined about what position we play last season. We play both play. But De Niro will last season. De Niro's playing inside right now. He's been playing Mike. Yeah. Is Cody Walker taking over one of those starting jobs? It, like he was out it depends on the package. It depends on what we're in. But yes, he's been very good for us. He's, he's very active. He's very versatile. Like I said, he can cover. He's a really good rusher. Um, but he gives us some flexibility with, uh, with what we're doing out there with his spot. 
I know that you guys say that you're a multiple defense just by nature, but how much more so do you think you'll do that this year based on some of the personnel issues that you have? Uh, we'll, we'll continue to do what we do, and which is, you know, we're going to be three down and we'll get in four down fronts as well. So we'll, we'll do both. You um, mentioned we're quite multiple in what we do, buds wise and coverage wise and all that. And we're playing a four down and three down front. I mean, it's not a whole heck of a lot more we can do. Yeah. When you mentioned depth, uh, how many of those ones slash twos are you talking about that you feel good about? And then how much deeper do you need to like getting? Yeah, I mean, we feel like, you know, it's hard. I, I, I bet if you asked any any uh, SEC head coach if they had a solid two deep across the board at every position, it would be probably pretty hard to come by. Um, so, you know, we know we're not going to ever play with, a, you know, with, with 10 alignment in a game and, and so on. But uh, but I do feel like we're getting where we need to be. When you're piecing three, four inside linebackers together that could play at a winning level for you, three or four outside linebackers, and uh, you know we need six or seven in D line, and uh, so we're, we're getting to that point. If you look at our receivers, we do feel good about two deep across the board, which is nice. We're certainly deep at the running back position. You know we're getting some depth at, at tight end, um, O line. We feel good about you know six, seven, eight guys that can play some winning football, which is nice to see, which we haven't had for a while. So we're getting depth. You know it, it comes in spots. Certain positions come together where you feel really good. You guys have seen the, the uh, growing pains we've had over the years with receiver. I mean, since I walked in here, that's been a position we've been we've been working every year relentlessly about building the depth at receiver. We finally feel like we have that. We have some players that are capable of making some big plays, and we have some depth to, to help them out. If you get an injury, it's not going to completely set you back. So what are you uh, we're getting there. What are you seeing from Alvante Bell? Alvante's making Bell? good progress. He really is. You, you know, it's still. Uh, you know, with, with with what we're doing and, and being as multiple as we are, putting it all together and being on point and being perfect in his assignments and technique, every play is, is always going to be a challenge, and we got to continue to push. But I like what he's doing. He's made a lot of made a lot of strides. Mark, what do you think about the, the other guys you put on scholarship last night? Yeah. Yeah, it was it was fun. You know, it's always rewarding. You know, we had the scholarships available with some attrition, some guys that wanted to go somewhere and play. So it was really nice to give it to the players that bust their tail every day. Uh, they do whatever we ask them to do, whether it's scout team, special teams, and, and uh, those guys have been around here. All three players that I put on scholarship are going to graduate this year, which is nice. We get the scholarship right back, and you get to reward them. And it was really nice to see our team really respond and be very happy for those guys because they know uh, the hard work and the effort that they put in. And there's there's more there's more walk-ons that, that are out here, and we couldn't function at a high level without them. And we appreciate all their work. Mark, has there been a, a guy over the course of camp that maybe you, you didn't know if you could count on that is showing you through these you know two and a half weeks that he can you can? Oh, uh, I, I don't know if there's any one guy. Maybe maybe Eli is a guy I feel like that, that's really uh, you know shown some really good signs, which we always knew he was going to be a good player. To how early or when uh, you were unsure. I think he's a guy that, that's stepping up. Yeah, Mark, it, it seems like the team is really supportive of each other this year. Uh, yeah. uh, how's team chemistry compared to previous years for you? Yeah, I think the team chemistry is wonderful. I really do. Our players have really invested a lot, and uh, they've worked hard. They've got a good mentality. They've had a good mindset, and uh, I've been very pleased with that. I really have. Uh, you know, even you know, late at night, we do constantly meet and walkthroughs, and. and uh, you know, we got speakers coming and talking to them, and they've been very attentive. And you know, they've they've done everything we've asked them to do, and uh, that's been fun to see. When do you officially start Southern Miss prep? Did you just? Uh, we'll start on Thursday. Folks, we need to get to our other coaches.